Unfortunately, I have to upload, so yeah, I used DJ Commander Farm Gladiator and Warden, and now I have a record in Happy Homes Roblox. Yeah, thanks for watching, subscribe. Yeah, anyways, I, I got I got a record in TDS speedrunning, so Tower Defense Simulator has a page on speedrun.com with actual people participating. Sometimes no actual people, but that's fine. If you don't know what a speedrun is, it's basically a run with speed. It, it, it's actually just that you're trying to complete a goal as fast as possible. The goal that I decided to try and beat was defeating the molten boss on the map Happy Homes Roblox here with event towers all by myself. If you've never seen this map before, it's probably because it's a community-made map, which makes it inaccessible to those in public servers because... Why? I don't know. Placed by the runner Keiki, the time that I needed to beat to claim first place in this would be 12 minutes sharp. You might be thinking, hey, I got like 12 minute runs. This would be really easy, and I thought that too. But the thing is with Happy Homes Roblox is that it uses round protection, and the ideal strategy would be to use Gladiator and Event Tower due to its cheap starting cost relative to its damage, making quick work of early waves. However, the thing about Gladiator is that it wields a sword. If it throws a sword, it doesn't have a sword, so it keeps it nice and tight in hand. But uh, this results in this tiny little circle of hit range, which I mean, motion in the ocean, not the size of the wave, but no amount of training allows the gladiator to hit the zombies as they spawn so early in the game, meaning that the zombies will have to slowly walk towards the range of the gladiator, losing precious time. Why didn't I use any other event tower like the Jester? For the first few games, I was just experimenting, and by experimenting, I mean hitting my head against the rock. Like, I did the same thing twice and expected a faster time. I tried using the Engineer, because the thought process would be, the Engineer doesn't have a wind-up like the Accelerator, so that means faster, right? Well, I did get a faster time of 12 minutes and 20 seconds, but the very next game with Accelerator, I got the exact same time. So, you know, I think it's a me problem. Instead of focusing all my energy on academics, I decided to see what I was doing wrong by watching the record holding run, and they placed accelerators by the streets to avoid them getting stunned, which is pretty smart. Hello, Edwin Wins here. My PC has crashed 14 times. While editing this rendition, this is the third edition of this video. This thing is actually cursed, so I want this video. G O N E in total, I did 17 attempts. Attempt 14, I switched to Warden for its no stun and high damage. I also figured out you can place behind the cave to kill the zombies quicker. I finished with a time of 11 minutes and 58 seconds, 2 seconds faster than KP. Good morning, good night.